this came out of skin after the shower. And I have to have black behind it. This was, I thought it was a hair, so I was just pulling it off. And then it started moving. This is very freaking me out. Horsehair Nemotomorpha. And it will just look like a piece of hair. And black thread when I look at them on like when I soak my skin and I look at them underneath um the magnifying loop. It um it looks like just a black thread. But this is I've never seen one come out of the skin like this like after I can feel them sometimes coming out in the water. Um, they like water, like, and I can see shooting stars in my eyes when I come out in the shower. But I've never seen one um, come out. I'm really freaked out. I don't know what to do. I've tried all the NA. He's whipping around. It's so gross. I've tried all the anti parasitic medication, and none of them have worked. And I don't know what else to do. My story is online, The Secret is Gratitude, and, um, dot com, and all the tests, and how we finally discovered what parasite it was. It's called Horsehair Nemotomorpha. It's, um, human diagnosis, and there's only been three cases diagnosed worldwide. They cling on, like if I stick my other something there, it wouldn't have to be a hand. Anything that it can grip onto, it gri would grip on. And then you kind of have to pull it off. It'll kind of attach itself. Um, and they come out of insects. It's normally an insect parasite, and they come out. Um, when they get wet. And so the hair was wet, um, watching a show doing fingernails after the shower and I thought it was a hair and just picked it up and started whipping around. Which is what hair starting Motomorpha does. And you can see I'm not moving my hand at all. There's no air conditioning on, there's no the swamp coolers right over to my right right six feet, it's not on, no breeze, uh, turn it up, it, it can move around, it goes that stays up, now if it was a piece of lint or whatever, it would not move like that and stand up straight and it would fall off my hand, it's clinging onto my finger. So, really gross. I hope some scientists will figure this stupid thing out because I am done with a stupid parasite. I'm terrified to, like I won't hold babies, I hold a blanket and I don't touch them and I don't cook food without gloves if I'm cooking for anybody. I'm just, the problem is I know I have this and so I'm really careful and cautious but other people don't know they have this and they're cooking for other people and serving food and holding babies and 
It's a water parasite, so if the baby's drooling on your arm and your arm's touching the baby's skin, I'm thinking it can go right through, because I've had a rash and then held my kids and like at the lake, and then they got a rash where I held them, and so we stopped using um, hand towels at all. We use paper towels now because of it, because I, we were spreading rashes back and forth, and anyway, so gross. Let me get it off my finger and see if I can get it to move. Okay, wait, did you see that? Watch. When it saw the, when it got, it got really excited. Let me see. Let me see if I can get it on film. It touches it and then it kind of gloms on. Now watch if I pull, oh, let go. I let go of my arm when I tried, I pulled it off before it came up. So, and that's slick, so, um, I tried to videotape it before on there, but it doesn't like the slick. It moved probably about a quarter of an inch in ten minutes, but, anyway, let's get it back on the skin. Oh, it did a loopy, loopy, flippy. But you can see horsehair in Motomorpha doing this on plants and things. They whip around like that. One lady, um got this out of her, I believe I'm getting it out of the cat pooping in the garden, and then we go barefoot in the yard, but she said she would got it from, you know, like it's kind of ring, ringed onto my finger now. You can't really feel too much when they glom on, but I'm paranoid about going outside anymore because I'm so sensitive to them, but I can feel a gripper. It kind of feels like I'm when a snake or an earthworm grabs onto you, but it's very, I'm just extremely hypersensitive now. I'm totally paranoid of them at night. I feel them, and I just hate it, but, um, anyway, you can see them when they're on plants and things, they whip around like that, but, and then watch, now, um, let me show you, sorry, I lost it again, okay, so, it wrapped itself around me, remember, I just touched it and picked it up, I'm getting too close, it's getting blurry, so, I, I, um, just touched my finger, all right, and I picked it up, and it was just barely hanging on, and then it whipped around, and now it's grabbed onto my finger, now watch, if I tip it, It should, if it was a piece of lint that I just picked up, it should fall off. But it's grabbing on. I mean, I can feel it grabbing on. So now it's whipping around. Oh, shoot, sorry. I'm looking at my hand instead of the... Let's see if I can get a better... It's got a bad angle with the... Okay. Get the reflections off there. Okay, so then it's whipping around, and then if I um, tip it, it should if it was just lint or something, come off. But this is a Gordian worm, and it ties itself in knots, and it holds on. So, that's long enough. Nobody wants to watch a disgusting parasite that came out of body for this long, but I just felt like I needed to video it and show it so that hopefully somebody will do something about it. I'm really frustrated anymore. I don't know what to do. So, uh, horse hernia multimorpha, human diagnosis. Let me put this back down and kind of get a measuring tape. Let's see if I can get it off my finger. There it goes. It let go. When it has something solid, it can move on to it. Well, let's go. So let me do this. Let me put it here. I'm going to grab a measuring tape. I think I have one. Let's see if I can get a measuring tape and measure it. So that's a good inch, and if it was strung out, that would be about an inch and a half strung out. Well, maybe not quite. Oh, stupid, it clinged on. There. It'll cling on to whatever you touch it next to. It does. It's kind of like a snake that way. So I'm guessing an inch and a quarter to an inch and that, towards an inch and a half from end to end. Anyway. Anybody out there who knows about parasites, please help me.